Hey, Victor Valley News Group. This is Hugo Valdez. Just bringing you guys a live update here on a train derailment that occurred here in Victorville today, Tuesday, December 20th. It happened at about eight o'clock here on the what's called the was considered the east side of Victorville between uh, near the area of Starter Wells and Highway 18. So if you're not still if you're still not familiar with where I'm talking about, uh, it's kind of uh, behind the uh, Victor Valley Hospital. The hospital's up on that hill. Uh, if you were to look back from that area, uh, you would look towards Apple Valley, Hesperia, and this is the direction looking towards the uh, Spring Valley Lake area. Not sure how good the quality is right now, but I'll speak and let you guys know what I information I've received so far. I did reach out to the Union Pacific representatives uh, who responded fairly quickly actually very quickly, to our request for information. Uh, and they did inform us that a Union Pacific train derailed at 8 o'clock uh, today. And again, on the east side of Victorville here, involving about 23 cars derailed altogether. And about half of those cars were on their side. Let's see if I can zoom in here. Yeah, the, about half of those cars were on their side. And if and uh, in this area of these trees, there's a lot of these large trees, this is where the cleanup is underway right now. They have some, uh, that's where in the middle of the screen right there, that's one of the cars that appears to be on its side. And that's the, you can actually hear a lot of thumping and clumping uh, sounds that are taking place from them, you know, moving them around and stuff. And then if you look down to the bottom right of the screen here, uh, they those are some heavy uh, like duty trucks, flatbed trucks that are here likely to, remove those uh, damaged uh, cars. So again, uh, what they informed us was that the Union Pacific, uh, these trains were carrying, uh, the, the cars were carrying iron ore and there were no injuries reported. And the Union Pacific is on the scene and the cleanup um, is obviously underway right now of the derailed cars from the right of the way. And the track has been closed uh, to traffic and it's unknown at this time when it's going to reopen so that is the latest here happening from victorville where again it happened at about eight eight o'clock this morning and it involved about 23 train uh train 23 cars that derailed from a union pacific train and they were carrying iron ore no injuries were reported the track has been closed ever since the accident happened and the cause of the incident is still under investigation so we don't know uh, what caused it here but this is again adjacent to the Mojave Narrows Regional Park uh, and this is behind the hospital here again it involved 23 cars if you guys go ch check out like ABC7 they had a helicopter here the helicopter just left a little bit ago I think they might have been doing like a live shot but they have overhead video of the uh, scene here so if you guys go check out one of those uh, news stations like Channel 7 I believe you'll be able to see some video from above but uh yeah not a lot of people heard about it don't be surprised uh someone just commented and said i'm surprised i didn't hear about it earlier but yeah a lot it's very the area is kind of rural in itself and it's very quiet so there's not a lot of traffic that go there's actually no traffic that goes through here so um you know it's, it's not a very not not a lot of people would have known about it but it, it did happen at about eight o'clock today the cleanup is underway and again thankfully no uh no serious no injuries were reported at all and no hazardous materials or anything like that because they were transporting iron iron ore but thank you guys for watching i appreciate it very much please go to our website vvng.com that is where you can always find more stories from around the area we do our best to cover as much as we can positive negative everything in between and thank you guys for always alerting us to all the stuff that is happening in the in around the victor valley thank you for watching robert appreciate you watching that's the community of spring valley lake in the background closest to us uh that's the you can see a little lake i don't know how clear the quality is but there's a little lake there and that's from the uh Mojave Narrows Park. So the Mojave Narrows Park is very close to where the train incident occurred, but no injuries. Stay safe, everybody. Till next time.